Hey guys, it's Vic with Haya, here to review the Casper Mattress. Full disclosure, we did receive this mattress for free. I slept on it for a total of eight nights. And also, keep in mind throughout this video that I am 6'5 and 260 pounds. So I do weigh more than the average person and a lot of my opinions will be based off of that. Let's talk a little bit about Casper. Casper was founded in 2013 in New York. They have about $240 million in funding which is a lot of money to make a great mattress. They have celebrity investors such as Tobey Maguire, Adam Levine, and Leonardo DiCaprio. Sugar, yes please, come and put it down on me. Next, let's talk a little bit about the price. First off, they start out with the full size at $895, a queen size at $995, and a king size at $11.95. This includes free shipping and a 100 night free trial. If you are not satisfied with this mattress, they will arrange for free pickup to return the mattress. That's pretty awesome, guys. Let's talk a little bit about the setup of the mattress. The mattress arrives directly to the consumer in a box. It comes in this spiral shaped wrapped up plastic. It's a little bit heavy, not as heavy as the Casper Wave. Um, I think you would be able to do it with just one person, depending on how strong you are. It takes about five minutes for the mattress to unfurl once you cut the plastic. Easy, no problem, you're ready to go. In my opinion, once it unfurls, it has a nice, sleek design. Uh, there's nothing too fancy about it. It's just this plain gray, uh, in my opinion, aesthetically pleasing design. There is a light odor that you get once you cut open the plastic, but it's nothing that will you know, drown you out or keep you awake, uh, no problem. The odor, I noticed, went away after about three or four days, um, so it didn't bother me at all. Finally, let's talk about the construction of the mattress. We did take the liberty of cutting the covering over the mattress to check out the layers, as you can see in the photo there. The first layer, is called the Comfort and Latex-like Foam. It is 1.5 inches. It's a proprietary layer that gives the mattress some bounce and breathability to prevent you from overheating. The second layer is the Memory Foam. This provides that contouring feeling to your body and a lot of pressure relief. Next, the third layer is the Zoned Support Transitional Layer. It provides additional pressure relief, more firm in the center, softer on the ends of the bed, giving your spine a neutral alignment and good weight distribution, as well as tailored firmness. The fourth layer is a dense foam. It is the foundation layer. It is made up of high density poly foam and provides the support and the foundation for the mattress. Let's talk about the comfort level and the firmness. I would rate this on about a seven uh, from on a firmness scale from 1 to 10 from extremely soft to extremely firm. It is a little bit more on the firm side uh, I personally prefer this one thing I noticed is when I first lay on the mattress You had this kind of a sinking feeling and after about a second the mattress contours to your body And it feels a little bit more firm. There is a consistent weight distribution throughout the entire mattress there are no noticeable soft spots. Uh, you can definitely sleep on the edge if you wanted to, no problem. I personally sleep on my side. I found the mattress to be perfect for that. A subject and I lay on the mattress together and took turns tossing and turning while the other lay still. And we were happy to report that there was no noticeable movement, nothing that will wake you up in the middle of the night if your partner is getting up and having to go to the bathroom or Lord knows what they're doing. Also, I did want to note, I do lay down in bed and watch Netflix every once and again, and it was perfect. It didn't hurt my back too much. It was perfect, that's all I really have to say. While I was lying on my back, I just want to take a second to mention that I do suffer from chronic back pain and the mattress did nothing to make it worse. Uh, I have to admit it didn't make it better, but it definitely did not make it worse, which is a huge plus for a mattress. Now, when I did sleep on a Casper Wave, it definitely took away my back pain, which was pretty awesome. So something to think about, folks. Next, let's talk about the temperature. As we all know, when you're sleeping at night, it is extremely important to have the perfect temperature. 
If you're too hot, you'll wake up. If you're too cold, you'll wake up. It has to be perfect. I have to say the Casper mattress was very good in that perspective. Now, it was a teensy weensy bit on the warm side for me, but then again, I do have to say that might be because of my size and just because of how large I am in general. Now, I do sleep with my window open and it is somewhere around the mid 40s here at night, so that might play a little bit of a part in how warm I felt in the bed. Bottom line, this is a great mattress. I woke up feeling rested. I didn't feel any excessive back pain. I mean, it's just an awesome mattress. Casper is definitely doing a good job with these things. Also, the price is not extreme. It's nothing crazy. Definitely affordable. Ships to your house, set it up in five minutes, and you're ready for a good night's sleep. Casper mattress, hi -ya!